The Maltese dog is an excellent companion breed, but what are the common Maltese behavior problems you should know and some helpful solutions as well? So let's find out. Number 1. Excessive Barking When Left Alone Maltese are a naturally non-aggressive tiny dog breed that has never been known to hurt other dogs or children because they were intended to be human companions. A Maltese dog can bark excessively, and one of the best methods to minimize excessive barking is to properly socialize your Maltese dog as soon as possible, and also provide a bark collar. Socialize your Maltese from the puppy stages, ignore unnecessary barking, and invest time to create training your Maltese. Maltese bark unnecessarily, and this barking can come at odd hours of the day. They also use barking as a means of communication which can sometimes be an issue for their owners. Number 2. Always begging for food It may be difficult for the owner to ignore the Maltese's enticing expressions, which promote begging. Despite the fact that begging is a bad habit to have, many Maltese owners reward their dogs by feeding them as they eat. Weight gain, gastrointestinal difficulties, and even persistent diarrhea are all possible side effects. The simplest way to avoid this annoying behavior is to never encourage it in the first place. But what can you do to stop my Maltese dog from begging? Here is the answer. When your Maltese is begging, don't stare at him. When your Maltese is begging, don't talk to him. If your Maltese dog attempts to leap on you while begging, twist and turn away. Teach your Maltese to do more than sit at the table asking for food. Number 3. Destructive Behavior of Chewing Valuables Chewing is a common habit for Maltese dogs, but if your Maltese chews on items that aren't meant to be eaten, such as shoes, furniture, or electrical wires, chewing may rapidly become a behavioral issue. To keep your Maltese dog busy and encourage healthy chewing, provide plenty of toys and shoes. Objects that you don't want chewed can be removed or sprayed with bitter apple, a material that leaves a bad taste in their mouth. Number 4. Leaping and Jumping on Their Owners Maltese dogs are known for leaping and jumping on their owners to greet you and express their delight at your homecoming. While leaping is enjoyable, it is not always suitable, and this might soon become a serious issue. Maltese dogs are noted for leaping up and down to welcome their owners and visitors. One of the most fundamental strategies for preventing your Maltese dog from leaping on you or another person is to teach them to control their excitement. Number 5. Difficulties in House Training the act of teaching a dog to defecate outside or in a specified location within the house rather than following its natural propensity of pooping everywhere is known as house training. Because of their domineering disposition, housebreaking a Maltese dog can be difficult. Expect to train in sessions for one to two months. Even after you've accomplished potty training, your Maltese dog may make blunders. However, once you've finished it, you may expect to see a cute dog. One of the most common difficulties with Maltese behavior is housebreaking. When you first obtain a Maltese, make an effort to focus on house training right away. Number 6. Maltese are prone to separation anxiety. Separation anxiety in Maltese is a behavioral issue that occurs when a Maltese is left alone for a prolonged amount of time without supervision. Separation anxiety, if not handled or resolved, can lead to biting, excessive barking, and animosity. Separation anxiety in Maltese is manifested by biting, nipping, barking, self-isolation, destructive chewing, and other behaviors. When a Maltese is left alone at home, separation anxiety can develop, which can be reduced by having a buddy or practicing effective crate training. Number 7. Clingy and Needy Behavior While some people find it unpleasant that their Maltese dog follows them around the house asking for affection, others find it amusing. When it comes to asking for attention by barking, biting, or nipping, Maltese dogs are no exception. A Maltese dog is not for you if you do not want a loving dog that requires constant attention. Maltese dogs make wonderful companion dogs that spend their days with their owners. Nevertheless, if not properly managed, they may become a significant problem. Number 8. Maltese dogs show bossy or dominance behavior. If you have children, Maltese dogs are known for being demanding and forgetting their size, which can be a serious concern. It's vital to properly socialize your Maltese dog to avoid domineering behavior. The desire for your Maltese dog to take the lead while you follow can lead to a range of behavior problems that, if not handled, can end in unneeded enmity. What to do if your Maltese dog has a bossy or dominance problem? 
as soon as possible. Establish yourself as the PAC's leader. As soon as possible, establish rules, constraints, and boundaries for your Maltese dog.